Gemini, welcome back. Let's go ahead and jump right into your reading. Find out what is coming towards the Gemini Collective. Right, Gemini. The Empress here, embodying beautiful energy, using your resources around you, embodying the the weather at this time might be really peaceful for you. Getting out into nature. Settling any conflict. Don't not being involved in any drama at this time, Gemini. You know that it's just going to drain your energy from you. That's awesome. So stay away from any gossip or anybody. I see you kind of wanting to get out of your comfort zone at this time. Yes, very much. You might have a lot of brilliant ideas. Oh, and a birthday coming up here. So there could be some confusion going on about all the possibilities that you can do. Don't let that overwhelm you. There you, will re you will be receiving news about a partnership, possibly someone actually a get-together here. Strengthening romance at this time within your partnerships. Looking really lovely, Gemini, Aries, energy. Here we are, the Hierophant within the community. So it looks like you're planning something within the community here. The World card, and we have the Queen of Pentacles. Being very generous at this time as well. So there's something that you're working towards or something that you're saving up for. Either a dream home or something. Somebody is working very hard here. Strong, trying to make ends pretty much meet, affectionate. But building a future, overall property, or some kind of fortune coming in. It is in reverse, but it is here overall. And it will bring in a lot of happiness. So, overall, you might want to be working towards something for the future here. Let's find out what Gemini can be doing to better their life. We have luck. Your luck is about to change for the better. So there is definitely a surprise coming in for the Gemini. You just might get that lucky break you're looking for. What a motivator you have been. Been lobbying, coaching, mentoring, these kind of things. You've been a little bit of a rebel lately. Now that old belief about money could be preventing you from getting ahead as well. So consider that. That you could be settling whenever you're a trailblazer meant to be like doing things. You feel like you maybe are salivating. So there's something about networking here. Maybe it's time to kind of reach out to someone or create uh, a, a way to be able to get a project out. Maybe the most uh, things are around you, all those resources that are around you, Gemini. Maybe you might be a little confused about all the resources that are here for you. Now, we do have the Hermit here, the Nine of Wands, and the Two of Pentacles. Something says pay attention real closely. Something still hurts you really, really bad. And overall, you need to take it easy. Perhaps you're worried that your partner is not committed. Sassatero. This says, no, somebody's working really hard. With the Six of Pentacles here. Could be around your birthday. So just, just keep things, you know, um, right. Keep focused on what you need to. Keep focused on the long haul. I, I see an honest lifestyle here, and there could even be an advocate here about what they do at work here. I do not feel like cheating is here at all. That's pretty cool. So maybe you might be in a relationship where you overall know that there has already been second chances here with the judgment card there was something that was public in the past already with the person that you were with here but for overall uh gemini collective do not settle for less you are quite a motivator understand that you can network you can get your ideas out through just being supportive and generous someone has recognized you at this time, I do see that you can bring in a strong mate or someone that more suits you if you are single at this time as well. 
something about a home here. Maybe you don't like the way where you live, these kind of things. It's kind of adding to some confusion. Maybe you're worried about theft. Here, I mean, you are uh, embodying this uh, Empress energy, and it's very loving overall. But there's something about working as a team here to build, let's say, a future. But at the same time, there's a warning here about staying independent regarding building your future here. It's almost like don't let someone take that power from you. You need to continuously work towards something yourself. And uh, if not, you know, they can go their own way. <laughs> they can go their own way because you're working towards something in the long term here but for it to come out just right you're not going to be you're going to have to do this one alone you're going to have to work towards this by yourself you know what <laughs> here's a little joke i had come up with and i, I just i had jotted it down so i want to say it to you I didn't, I didn't tell no other sign this but i have a tooth gap <laughs> It sets me apart from the rest. <laughs> you know, I just thought that was kind of cute. Uh, so if anybody has like a tooth gap or anything, you know, you definitely, your teeth set you apart from the rest. <laughs> Too cute. Okay. But anyway, um, Gemini, you have a lot of love coming in for you. But at the same time, you know, you have a birthday. Yay to you, Gemini's. And let's go ahead and see in this tarot card what we can do to get you all in alignment. And it says the solar plexus. I can't make it up. Okay. The chakra is located at the navel. Its function is to give you momentum to move forward and realize your desires and intentions. So if you've been feeling that, that like activated right now to to kind of get out there and be that adventurous gangsta that is for you to realize right now this is a time to kind of fulfill those intentions that you have been trying it's like take a step forward stay away from gossip though do not entertain anything like that do not cut nobody else down to size you know i see uh taurus was not going through the best Time right now so chakras are basic con concentrated energy centrus of the body they're used in a variety of ancient meditation and practices it's a sanskrit term meaning wheel or disc for thousands of years these have been studied and incorporated into a wide variety of spiritual practices working with your chakra has been linked to increasing your lifespan and improving your physical mental and emotional well-being so while you're out there networking, be considering yourself, taking care of yourself, like your mental and emotional well-being as well as your physical well-being, you know, that that kind of takes you taking look out uh look out for yourself as well. So there's also a fine balance that is coming out in this reading as well. One more before we move on to any yes or no questions. Be thinking of three yes or no questions. I'll answer them one by one. Fire. <laughs> Face the south direction of your circle. Use a compass for assistance. Hold up your athame and recite the following. Mary meets south, element of fire. Your flames of passion, heart, and vision ignite us. We ask for your bold strengths and our rights. Motive to be... Guide, teaching, illuminating our rights. So, something, something definitely is more than illuminated in you at this time. So you are basically like a little ball of energy and you have got to get out there. Meetings and things are significant at this time for you. Uh... Pretty much hold in there. 
Gemini, this is what I have for you. If you're single, it won't probably be for long. <laughs> you know, a uh, wonderful reading I had for you. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. And until next time, let's keep this energy going.